All right, so today we're looking at place values and expanded form. This is going to teach us how to read big numbers aloud. So here's our first example. Let's say we have a number like this, 123. Right, so we look at the place values. This three is on the ones column. This two is on the tens column. And this one here is on the hundreds column. So we've got the place value. So let me write it now in expanded form so that we can read the number aloud. So first we have our three here. It's in the ones column. So you're going to say three times one. Then for our two, we're going to say, since it's in the tens column, you're going to say two times 10. And then our one here is in the hundreds column. So we're going to say one times hundred. So basically here we've put this in expanded form. You say three times one plus two times 10 plus one times 100. So if we multiply three times one, we get three. If we multiply two times 10, we get 20. And if we multiply one times 100, we get 100. So our number is 123. When you add these together, 3 plus 0 plus 0, that is 3. 2 plus 0, that is 2. We bring down our 1. So 123. Let's look at a bigger number now. So the, before we even go to the other number, so in expanded form, you write it like this. I'm going to say, so it'll be 3 times 1. plus 2 times 10 plus 1 times 100. All right. This is how you put it in expanded form. Then you do the calculations and then you get your resultant figure. So let's look at another number. All right. So before I read out the number, I would say this five here is in the ones column. The three here is in the tens column. The four here is on the hundreds column. And the two here is on the thousands column. I mean, yes, thousands column. So let's put this now in expanded form. So we've got this five here. So we're going to say, since it's in the ones column, we're going to say five multiplied by one here. We're going to have three 
multiplied by 10 next we have 4 multiplied by 100 and then 2 multiplied by a thousand So we're going to do our multiplication here. So we'll say 2 times 1,000, that is 2,000. 4 times 100, that is 400. 3 times 10, that is 30. And 5 times 1, that is 5. So if I have to read this number, it is... 2,435.